One turtle, all we're gonna do is add an S, and now we have turtles. That's right, very good. Now, if we have more than one goose, it would be? It'd be gooses? No, it's geese. You don't see how? It, it's because it's more than one goose. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Here, let me, let me give you one more try here. Uh, let's do this right here really quick. Let's do this right here. What word is that? Moose? Moose, yes, very good. So more than one moose would be? Meese? No. I mean, mooses? Nope. Uh, mooses? It'd be moose. You don't see how? If we have one moose, it would be moose. But if we have multiple moose, it would be moose. Okay. So if this word is wine, this word would be maga. It'd be magazine. Magazine. You don't see how that... That's all right. Oh, okay. you know, I'll give you another one, okay? All right. So if this is magazine, this word would be porcu... Porcupine? Porcupine. You don't... Oh. Under... You're just not getting it. It's okay. It's okay. Uh, give me... I'll, I'll do another one for you. All right. So you know this word? River. River. Yes. Okay. Good. So you are getting the hang of it. So if that's river, then this right here would be... Diver. No, it's diver. You don't... Oh, okay. It's okay. G let me give you one more, okay? Okay. All right, so first word is thread. Thread, yeah. Which means this word right here would be... Red. Well, it depends. So this word is... Hour. Which means this word is... Sour. Which means this word is... Tower. Tor. You don't see how... It's because it's, like, not the same. Like, that's why. Okay. Yep. Here, how about this one? If we take this R and we make it a P, what's this word now? It'd be salp. As in chicken noodle salp? N no, it's soup. You don't see how? It's because the P makes the O-U oop. That's why. But now that you know that, let's say this P is an L. Now what's this word? Soul. No, it's soul. You don't see... Okay. Clearly, I'm not doing my job well enough. So this word is... Rock. Very good. Now come up and spell the word knock. Spell the word knock. N-O-C-K, knock. No. There's a K. You don't see how... Just because you can't hear the K doesn't mean it's not there. Oh. Spell it with a K, but when you say it, pretend it's not there. Spell it. Say it. Spell it. Say it. See what I mean? Oh, okay. <laughs> so now that you know that, what's this word right here? Um, pretend it's not there. So it'd be now? No. Can you tell me what it is then? No. Here, last one here. Come up and spell the word not. K-N-O-T, not. Spell the K, say it like it's not there. Not. Not the knot I was talking about. So which prey is correct? Well, it depends. Because? Because they're like not the same. I think you're starting to see how. Which means these two words aren't spelled the same because... Because they're like not the same? No. You don't see how. Just because they're not spelled the same doesn't mean they're not the same. But when two words sound the same and are spelled the same, that means they're the same. Well, it depends. I mean, this right could mean like the opposite of left, and this right could mean like correct. Or uh, it could be right as in if you don't understand, you have the right to ask questions. So, so what sound does this make? The ch sound. Which means this word is chew. Which means this word is Chef? No, it's chef. You don't see how? It's because it's French. Oh. That's why. Oh, okay. But when it's not French, what sound does this make? The ch sound. Which means this word is? It'd be chemistry. Chemistry. You don't see how? Just because the H is there doesn't mean it wants to be part of the word. Mm-hmm. But when the H wants to be part of the word, it'd be chat. Which means this word is... Champagne. 
No. What did I say about French words?